Living along the Gulf Coast means most of us are thinking about hurricane season, but tonight the city of Houston says there's another weather threat we can't forget about, and it's controversial climate change. New research from the Texas Tech Climate Center claims the years ahead will be filled with longer, hotter summers and warmer winters and stark differences by the end of the century. Our Roseanne Aragon is live tonight in the Eastern Glades portion of Memorial Park. And Roseanne, how did this project come about? Yes, this assessment came at the request of the city as part of its long-term sustainability and resilience plan. But we can all understand this hot, hot weather in Houston. The study examined temperature and precipitation across greater Houston, looking at how humans and climate affect each other. Heat, heat, and more heat pretty hot. The worst part about it is the humidity. As for fall, it's very hot, but somehow you feel like there is a glimmer of hope. But just released a closer look at where Houston is heading long term, a completed climate impact assessment for the greater Houston area funded by C40 cities. Analyzing data from more than 10 weather stations across greater Houston, Texas Tech Climate Center researchers suggest that this century, greater Houston will experience longer and hotter summers, warmer nights, and even winters. This study is one aspect of the Houston Climate Action Plan on our resilience strategy. The assessment indicates that by 2100, summers will start in May and last as long as October, with the number of days of more than 100 degree heat more than doubling what it is right now. And it means that we're going to need more air conditioning more often. And it also impacts um, the elderly, uh, it impacts young children. Scientists also forecast the same amount of hurricanes here, but more powerful and with warmer water, more precipitation, flooding and heavier rain paired with more droughts. But the study compares the severity of weather in relation to our carbon footprint. And so this is crucially important to um, everything that we are working on in Houston right now when you think about climate action, because it shows the power and the possibility of what we can do today. Officials say this is Climate Week for the full study. And for more on Climate Week, you can head to GreenHoustonTX.gov. Reporting live from the Eastern Glades, Roseanne Aragon, KPRC. Channel 2 News. Roseanne, thank you.